7 continues with the national doubleheader game from the home of the Super Bowl champion Tampa Bay Buccaneers hosting the Chicago Bears on CBS. Hello friends, Jim Nance along with my friends Tony Romo and Tracy Wolfson. We've got an interesting little matchup here at the quarterback position because the gap by years between the two is the largest in the history of the game. And the interesting thing is they both, with age, seem to be getting just a little bit better. <laughs> just like you. Even, even that guy, number 12. I'm telling you, it's somehow he's turning back uh, the times of father time, right? But, I mean, he's incredible. We know that. Every year, he somehow gets better. But I'm seeing, as an organization, you want to see your rookie quarterback get better, right? He's improving. Justin Fields is showing things that you want to see. He's turning and ripping some of these balls in there. He just needs to learn the game right now. That's really what it's about. All right, deeper dive, if you will. How about the man who leads the league right now in passing already over 2,000 yards, looking for his 600th career touchdown pass today? Well, if it's possible, he's gotten better, and he really has. He's got more weapons around him right now, but he knows the game. It's really hard to disrupt him. You're not going to out-scheme him, right? Your job is to win up front and get him in third down and manageable and get off the field. And for Fields, his first start was week three, and you have seen incremental improvement every week. I have. It's almost like someone comes from Ohio State, right? They just snap the ball, and they just throw to all these great players. And right now, he's got to read the field, and he's got to know defenses. And he's learning every single week, every single rep, and I see it. I actually think he's going to be a really good player in this league. Okay, there are some absences that are notable. And for more on that, let's go to the sideline. Here is Tracy. Well, Jim, Tom Brady without two of his weapons today. Rob Gronkowski still out without rib injury. Antonio Brown out today with an ankle. They also will be without Levante David and Richard Sherman. But as for the Bears, they are dealing with COVID issues right now. Three players in the last 24 hours, five in the last 11 days. They do get running back Damian Wilson back, Williams back today. So that's a good thing, but a lot of holes to fill for both of these teams, guys. Oh, no question, especially with those uh, two on the Tampa Bay offense, two of the favorite targets for both Gronk, who's out again with the broken ribs and a b but it's going to be chicago football first the bears won the toss and said we will take the football these teams that met last year week four at soldier field and the bears won that one in a nail biter 20 to 19. we've had some rain in fact 